Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to learn Windows 10 feature and the start menu is back and we're going to learn how to use it, where to find start menu, what does it show, access all the apps using start menu, how to pin items to start menu and taskbar, where to find mostly used items in start menu. Here is my uh, computer right here. I have installed uh, Windows 10 and uh, let me go ahead and quickly show you. Uh, if you look at the uh, left corner of your PC, a little window right here, that is the start menu. It doesn't say basically uh, a start like it used to say in Windows 7, but in Windows 8, it used to have this icon right here, Windows icon. If you click that icon right here, you will see that uh, um, there are two columns basically appear right here. One is right here in the left side and other is tile based. Keep in mind that this is uh, the left side is more towards Windows 7 and right side right column is more towards Windows 8. So if you have if you're used to and like the Windows 7 the way that Windows 7 does this is your column. So uh, up here uh, there are file explorer settings power uh, apps these are the mostly uh, things used in Windows 7 when uh, Microsoft did this survey that uh, when you click on here um, on start menu mostly people will go to settings either power um, or file explorer so in order to if you look at the power right here we have option to shut down and start uh, our PC from right from uh, uh, the start button that it used to be in Windows 7. If you click on File and Explorer right here, let me close this and click on this little arrow, it will take you to the desktop, downloads, uh, documents, uh, pictures. And File Explorer used to uh, is one of the mostly free, uh, most frequently used uh, item in Windows 7 and Windows 8, so it w it is put in Start Menu. So this Start Menu is uh, more than just the Start Menu it used to be in Windows 7. Again, it's a uh, uh, best of both worlds. So right here is your desktop downloads. If you want to quickly go to your downloads, uh, documents, pictures, music, and videos. Now, other item right here is mostly used item. If you start using uh, something more more frequently it would show up here it was missing in Windows um, 8 so um, um, it, it is back right here it makes life much easier if you have your mostly used item because uh, I have found that very useful you can see right now it's a newly installed uh, item. basically I haven't used Windows 10 much so that's why it is uh, getting me uh, getting me started on some things that's uh, um, been used mostly um, even after install this this is my start right here get started paint people calculator notepad alarm uh, so in order to go to the settings that uh, also was frequently used if you click on settings you will see uh, a nice little window right here that has system devices and all other good stuff if you would like to look at the system where we used to click on start button and right click on computer and go to properties and get the system it's right here just couple clicks and you get into the system as you can see all the features of the, your system right here if you click about it'll tell you that what edition and what pr processor and RAM and all that uh, kind of good stuff in here so let's go back to the start menu up here this is the right column um, this has the tile based all the um, apps that was in Windows 8 a tile based uh, view right here you can basically change the size of your start menu you can do it right here if you move this right here it will basically change let me close this and let me expand this so this is how you can change the size of uh, your start menu or the desktop if you click on here right click you will see the same menu that you used to see in Windows 8 so that hasn't uh, uh, hasn't been gone so they added it in last minute basically but uh, some people like this one uh, especially all the uh, admin side of the house it is uh, right here if you right click on that but if you just simple click on the start menu it's a Windows 7 enhanced view of start menu so um, let's go ahead and check that if you wanted to see all your apps you know you in Windows 7 there used to be a little arrow down here and you click and it'll show you all the apps in tile view but if you are um, you prefer to use the start menu and wanted to look at the scroll 
of your all apps click on all apps right here as you can see all your applications are right here now if you wanted to pin any item uh, on your you have two options either pin to start menu or you can pin it on your taskbar let's say that um, I, if I right click on that it says pin to start pin to taskbar if I wanted to pin to start right here it will pin to start right here I don't remember where I is this the I, I believe this is the calculator I pin let me do the people pin to start and right here it appeared so it pinned to the start now let's go ahead and pin to the taskbar this is your taskbar uh, this look a little bit new we'll cover that in uh, uh, next video so let's go ahead and pin MS paint to our taskbar if you click on pin taskbar it's gonna appear right here see you can pin on your start and on your taskbar so uh, let's see that uh, what else do we need to cover I think we covered almost anything if you don't know um, that if, if you have any question uh, that uh, where to put stuff please uh, leave that in comments and we'll be happy to help you out there and I hope this little demo helps